Okay, so uh, this is Chris with the uh, Land Cruiser, April 27th today. Um, so this is a 1994 Toyota Land Cruiser. It's been my personal 80 series Land Cruiser for, the, for over a year now, uh, and I've enjoyed, really enjoyed this vehicle. Um, I really don't even wanna sell it, to be honest. I, I really like it a lot. The only reason I put it on the market, it, or I'm willing to sell it now, is because I just got another one that I was waiting on a year that came in from Dubai. Uh, that's a manual transmission, but I'm not selling that one. I'm keeping that one. Um, so it's time for me to let this one go. But it's it's really been an awesome truck. It's never let me down. Uh, it's got dual battery set up, so it'll never die on you. Uh, tires are practically brand new. The uh, It's got a steel uh, worn uh, ARB uh, front bumper with a uh, steel cable uh, winch 12,000 pounds uh, these lights both work with different uh, they've got different switches so for your uh, your spotlights and your uh, LED bar um, let's see it's got new paint and uh, also got the uh, Safari snorkel tires are powder coated This folds out like that. Okay. No rust. Usually these rust in here, there's no rust. No rust. Um, tailgate is used for, uh, you can, it's like a bench, you can sit on it. They're really great, uh, especially if you're into off-roading. Uh, you can cook on it, you can do all sorts of stuff. So, I wish more SUVs were set up like that. But I love the tailgate where you can actually sit down and hang out with your friends. It's a lot of fun. Don't have the uh, third row jump seats. Tow package. And then this just lifts up. Two hands. clips into place and it's locked in place right there. Backup LED. Uh, spoiler on the on the rear tailgate. And uh, let's take a look underneath. Usually the skid plates on the fuel tanks rust. There's no rust. Frame is pretty much clean. So practically a rust-free truck. Little bit of surface rust on the exhaust there that's no big deal but overall just really uh clean truck look inside got glass headlights so um wood trim uh interior is in really good shape cloth seats are in fantastic shape almost no wear on the steering wheel horn works Um, so here's your switch for your spotlights. If you want to turn your spotlights on, they're re very bright. It's got a Alpine radio uh, um, with uh, Pioneer speakers in all four doors that work great. Uh, power sunroof that works. Okay. All the lights on the inside have been replaced with LEDs. Same with the back. Here's your uh, your four by four. So you just put it in neutral, put it down into low. Okay, now you're uh, you're locked into your uh, four low. Back in the neutral, put it back into high. Okay, now you're out. Here's your center locking differential. When you press that, the center locking differential comes on. Now you've locked the diff for off-roading. Only use that if you get in a jam, if you're stuck or you got a wheel spinning 
Uh, then you can lock it, go ahead and turn it off. And um, now it's off. Over here you have uh, your switch for your, uh, right here is for your winch. So if you wanna turn your winch on, do that. And then right here is the, the winch. Seats are in great shape. Same with the seats in the back. Headliner is in excellent condition, no sagging, anything like that. Drives great. Um, like I said, I, I really only used it for like weekends. If I was going to the lake, I'd take it to the lake or uh, if we ever wanted to go, like there's a couple mountains that we can go to, um, go drive through the trails and the mountains with this. And that's pretty much all I do. And it's a ton of fun. Performs amazing. It's a great truck. Air conditioning's cold. Uh, power antenna works. Right there. So really no issues, everything's working. Uh, your parking brake, no check engine lights, and it drives fantastic. Thanks for watching.